Hi, and welcome to a Real Estate Minute brought to you by David Weekly Homes with a quick view of some opportunities you can read about in the Denver Post this weekend in this brisk spring real estate market. I'm Mark Samuelson, and this weekend you'll find stories on a new Douglas County master plan that's only 15 minutes from the Tech Center about how close the newest residents in Stapleton are to a 25 square mile wildlife refuge and how Stapleton's incredible popularity is luring a new elementary school and fire station to neighborhoods north of I-70. That latter story by Denver Post business writer John Murray reports on a complex agreement to bring a new elementary school, fire station, and other improvements to fast-growing neighborhoods near Northfield at Stapleton Shopping Center, the newest area to demonstrate Stapleton's growing popularity with buyers. Some 23,000 residents and 10 million square feet of commercial development have been lured to Stapleton since its transformation from Denver's airport into a master plan. The new agreement involving the City of Denver, DPS, Developer Forest City Stapleton, the Denver Urban Renewal Authority, and a Metro District is partially aimed at financing a 6th Stapleton Elementary School north of East 56th Avenue. You can find that story at denverpost.com. Meanwhile, David Weekly home buyers coming to Stapleton's newest neighborhood at Beeler Park are discovering just how close they'll be to the new Rocky Mountain Arsenal Wildlife Refuge, already open a quarter mile north from where their new homes are being completed. I talked with home buyer Eric Stoller, who hiked into the area from his home site and came back with great shots of large lakes with accessible shoreline for pike and bass fishing, island waterfowl habitats, and prairie expanses where there's a growing bison herd roaming. Stoller and his family of four landed a new four-bedroom home in De Beeler Park. Stoller and his family of four landed a new four-bedroom home in Beeler Park after a search of resales and other builders around town that led them to David Weekly's two model homes you can tour this weekend a mile south of Beeler Park site. They're getting a Salida plan from the Prairie Collection, just over 2,600 finished square feet with a main floor study, open concept kitchen entertaining area, upstairs laundry, two car attached garage, and a finished basement option with guest suite and play area. At Beeler Park, they'll take advantage of an Adirondack-styled park with splash pool and a parkway designed as a country esplanade with orchards and wildflower meadows in a location that works for commuting downtown or for business trips out to DIA. Single-family cottages start from $472,990 from $416,990 for paired homes designed like duplexes. Eric Stoller says that they've received great customer service. You can pick a site in Beeler Park or opt for a home that David Weekly can deliver in time for the new school year, including one that's set for August move-in with a base price of $472,990. To reach David Weekly's show homes, they're south of Beeler Park's neighborhood site. Head north from Central Stapleton on Central Park Boulevard, two miles to a Northfield Boulevard, Turn left a half mile to Uinta Street, close to the Northfield Shopping Center. Head north on Uinta a block to East 49th Place and west to the Models. Or visit davidweeklyhomes.com. I'm Mark Samuelson. You can see my story on this and other real estate happenings at dphomes.today.